Hello everybody, Ray Williams, Branch Manager and Mortgage Maestro Group here in Denver, Colorado. I'm going to share with you some perspective on the 30-year fixed rate for mortgages compared to the Fed funds rate. First, you have to understand they're not one and the same and the Fed does not drive mortgage rates. Second, um, been charting this, looking more recently at the comparison between current policies and what happened in 04. Not that they're doing it at the rapid pace they did back in 04, 05, and 06, but they have been increasing it more consistently here as far as the uh, Fed funds rate goes. So, historically speaking, uh, nominal changes to the Fed funds rate have an immediate impact that is positive to 30-year fixed rate mortgages. That's right, I said positive, not negative, much to the demise of the media. However, back in 05, after they had increased it so many times, we then started seeing increases to the 30-year fixed rate, the delayed impact there. Uh, at the end of 15, they increased it uh, just uh, the one time through latter part of 16, and the 30-year fixed rate mortgage went down throughout the year in 2016. At the beginning of 17, after they had increased it at the end of 16, 30-year fixed rates went down again, but now that they've done quite a few increases, we're starting to see it go up much like that at the end of 05 and in 06. So I'd be curious to see where it goes from here if they do continue to raise the Fed funds rate. Let's see if I can get you to take a look at this chart. So mind my raw footage, but that's just how I kind of roll. So hope you're okay with that. Take a look at the chart there. On the left, you see kind of the impacts to 04, 05, and then what happened in 06 to the average 30-year fixed rate mortgage. And of course, this data is information I found on the Fed funds rate website uh, and also the St. Louis Fed site as well. So from there, you see what happened in 2015 uh, as far as that one-time increase and what happened to 30-year fixed rates on mortgages after. And then look kind of what's going on now that they've been increasing it quite a few times. What you see is that the 30-year fixed rate of mortgages is starting to go up. So. What happens next? Well, it kind of depends on what they decide to do. If we continue to see Fed funds rate increases, we could see the 30-year fixed rate continue to slide up on mortgages. That's where working with a lender who can lock in your loan before you're under contract is uber critical. Uh, check with your lender to see if they can do that. We are able to offer that. Anyways, any more questions about this, reach out to me, and I hope you're having a great day. You can reach us on Instagram, Facebook. Go ahead and send and give us a call on the phone back there. Uh, mortgage-maestro.com and hope you're well.